Okay, this will be an interesting tutorial. We have Amita here today, and we're gonna do some summer updos, and we're going to keep it as simple as possible and keep the intro as short as possible. So let's go. I look good. I look so good. I look like Elsa after she had all these years, all these years, all these years wearing that, and finally she took it out. Then took out her ponytail and then voila! Just my hair. I am like an angel, like Elsa. And I'm just named Amina and I'm not. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to. You're so vain. <laughs> Okay, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start by making a part and it's gonna be a little deeper than the normal part on her head. We already put a little bit of leave-in conditioner in. So we take this section right here and we split it into two. It's essentially a French braid, but I am just pulling little sections from the same point on the top of her head, right here. If you guys can hear that laughter, those are my two rebellious boys that are supposed to be napping. We're going to let it slide. We're having some girl time. Right, Nina? Yeah. We're sorry that this is ruining our video. Let's see if we can get a better view for the peeps. So she needs people. Don't worry. Oh. Sorry, my dear. <laughs> they taught us in beauty school that if you can't take your mannequin head off of its stand and shake it upside down, without the hair staying put, then you didn't do a, a solid updo. So we're just finishing off the braid. Okay, so when you get to the end here, don't pull this through, leave it like that, okay? And then we are going to shove it in Right there. And what all these little bumps and lumps up. Se secure, right? So now I'm just taking some pins and securing everything. Oh, I look beautiful but like a boy. You cute as a button. Queen Amida. Oh, look at that. Look at that regal profile. I look very fancy. Yeah. We are going to go in and we're going to make two ponytails one at the top of the head, and then we're going to make one right below it. You can hold your first ponytail and kind of shake. Get some of those bangs out if that's your choice. Right at the tippity top. Then we put that into another elastic. Okay? So get both of those out of the way. And then we're going to take a third section. But instead of putting this one into a ponytail, we're going to take the top section, the first ponytail, and we're going to split it into two. Okay? Get that out of the way. We're going to wrap 
wrap it around the middle pony. So that's what it should look like. Doesn't need to be super tight. So then that's looking like that. Tall meet up, tall, tall. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna split this little guy into two. And you guessed it, we're gonna go right around. So we're gonna leave this piece right here out. And keep going. So any ponytail that's above the other ponytail, you're gonna split it and wrap it. We'll finish it off with a little purple tie. As I'm gonna pull each of these little segments apart. Okay, for this one, keep the part or get rid of the part, doesn't matter. But we are going to do another multiple pony style. So loosely tie off a section and we're gonna do three sections and you don't the only thing I will say about um, being specific is you don't want them to be really far apart you want all three of these ponies somewhat close you can even do this on the side it doesn't need to be in the center of the head. You remember in the 90s where there were commercials for that gadget that would uh, flip your hair over? You don't need a gadget, but just take your thumbs and flip the ponytail through the parting. Same thing here. Messy is key. Same thing with this middle section. Just keep twisting, twisting, twisting. And that's where you pin it. So see it just did that on its own right here. Okay. And twirl them, twirl them, twirl them until they start to make these weird kinks. So the reason why I felt like I should share this is because you don't even have to have eyes back here. I thought it would be really nice for adults to have this in their back pocket. If you guys don't have a wet brush, I highly suggest you get one because it makes this process a lot easier. And they have so many fun themes, I guess you'd say. She has um, Anna and Elsa, Pocahontas. Yeah, I chose those out. So they're mine, but I let people use them, right, Mama? Right. So you can put this ponytail anywhere. You can do it really high on top of the head or you can just do it um, midway, whatever. You can leave the bangs out, however you feel. Just like kids do. They buy stuff, but I share it because I'm the one who bought it. I'm the one who chose it. 
so I bought both of those, but I still share. That is right. Just like for Christmas, I did all of that, but I share. And Philip has a foam green sword, and I had a pink glow stick wand, and I had that. For Christmas, I got it. Sorry about that. And okay, okay, try to Kathy. Turn around. Okay, so we have a very basic ponytail, and then what you want to do, if she has, so if anyone that is getting this style has um, little short pieces, then that's okay. Um, just work some texture into it. You can make it more messy if you want, or you can um, make it more smooth. This is the sexy hair texture. There it is. Um, it's awesome. It's like somewhere between like a dry shampoo and a hairspray. And you're just going to wrap it around when you get back to the starting point. You're going to take another little section and add it together. But basically, you're just going to follow that down until it can't go any further. four hairstyles for you or your little one. I hope you learned something. I hope you liked this. If you did like this video, turn on your post notifications and the biggest of all, subscribe. That would be amazing. This is Megan Marie and Amita and we are signing off. Thank you so much guys. Have a great day. We hope you liked it.